So today's video is probably the biggest mistake I see most golfers make. And undoubtedly after watching this, you'll get told this by playing partners. The good news is you'll be able to correct them so that they don't keep making that mistake. So, so many golfers will set up, get themselves in position, set up, hit the shot, and the ball might end up getting back to target. But once they hit a couple of loose ones, playing partners are very, very quick to come in with the comment, well, the ball was bound to go there because that's where you were aiming. Now, makes sense, doesn't it? The only problem is they'll get you to set up and they'll put the club down by your feet and say, that's where you were aiming. Now, first thing is, that's wrong. We don't aim with our feet and our body. We aim with the club face. So we always need to make sure that we build our setup around the golf club for our address. So I'm going to presume initially that most golfers would want to hit the ball straight. So a fairly neutral setup. Now the problem for most golfers tends to be that because they put their feet down first, they align their feet at the target. So the next problem is they understand about the parallel lines. So they would then aim the club way off to the right. Now, because almost subconsciously they know that they're aimed wrong, in the swing you then see compensations being made to try and get the ball back to target. So initially if we're going for the straight shot, what you would be looking is get your grip done with the club face, nice and neutral. You're gonna aim the club down the middle of the fairway or at the flag if you're on a par three, and then align your feet parallel but left. And then from there, you can stand up and make your swing. Straight down the middle, and we're never asking for that one back. Now, obviously most golfers find it incredibly difficult to hit that dead straight shot, but we're still, depending on our shape, gonna build our setup around the club face. So let's say you're somebody who fades the golf ball. You know that if you aim straight, you're gonna miss off to the right hand side. So again, you're gonna get your grip, get that club face correct. You're gonna then align the club, aim that club face down the left side of the hole. Once the club face is in position, you can then align your body parallel, but left again of that club face and make your swing. And that one will shape back from starting down the left, shape back into the middle. And then obviously if you're a drawer of the golf ball, more like I would be, you're gonna go the opposite. So you're gonna get that grip done, control the club face there, aim that club face more up the right hand side, set up nice and square to that, and then put your swing on it. And that one's gonna curve back from starting down the right to the middle of the fairway. But like I said, it's such a big mistake that golfers make. They talk about aim all the time, but show me alignment. And remember, alignment isn't just feet. Because people get feet in incorrect positions, their then body aligns poorly. So you always want to make sure club aims first, then your feet, if you're parallel to that, and then your knees, your hips, and your shoulders all running in the same line. I'm not promising that's going to make a nice neutral swing and hit the ball straight, but it is going to give you the best chance from setting up well, aiming correctly, hitting the shot. Now you do also have to remember that just because you aim that club face in the right place at address, if you don't get it back there at impact, the shot's still not going to go where you want. But don't start making that biggest mistake I see golfers make. Where have I aimed? Let me check where I've aimed. Remember, you don't aim with your feet and your body. You aim with the club, you align with your feet and your body. So always check where you've aimed the club face, then you can align your body, make your swing from there, and straight away, that will get you hitting better golf shots.